For our children's sermon today, I'd like to talk to you about light. Jesus talks about light in our gospel story today, and light is usually something that's a really good thing. Light helps us to see things that are far away. Light helps us to be able to appreciate the beauty of something when we can see it. And light sometimes just makes us feel good. Last couple of days have been kind of nice and bright and sunny and warm, and we sit outside in the light, and it helps us to feel better. But I learned, I learned a long time ago that light is also helpful to see things that are not so good, things that are a mess, things that are problems. So one of my favorite features on my phone is the light here, this little light. It's a tiny little light, but sometimes, when there's a problem, and I can't figure out what the problem is, I shine the light there, and I go, oh, that's the problem. And when I can see the problem, then I can fix it. Then I can clean up the mess. You know, sometimes we don't want to see what the mess is. We think, well, we'll just ignore it by turning off the light. We'll keep it far away and not look at it. I did that when I was a kid. Maybe you've done this too, where my mom or my dad said, it's time to clean up your room, and I'd turn off the light and go, I don't see a mess. What mess? There's no mess there. But it was still there. Thing is, if you turn on the light or if you use the light and you can see the mess, you can see the problem, then you can fix it. You can clean it up. You can make it better. When Jesus talks about the light coming into the world, he doesn't mean the light's going to come into the world and tell you how bad you are. He means he's going to help us to see things that are a mess, that are a problem for us and for other people. Not so we can feel bad about them, but so that we can go, oh, look at that. We can clean that up. We can change that. We can fix that. Jesus is helping us all the time when things are bad in our lives, when things need to have the light shined on them, so that we'll be able to be people who can follow Jesus by cleaning up things, fixing problems, and helping other people to be able to fix the problems that they face as well. Thank you guys very much for listening.